Hello, my name is Karen King Aribi Sala, and this is Karen's Kingdom, where I read from my own works and from the works of other writers, and also sometimes give you, render some interesting bits and pieces about some of my experiences. But today I'm going to uh, recite an extract from a short story of mine entitled Our Wife, and it is from my first published collection of short stories entitled Our Wife and Other Stories. Actually, this collection won the best first book prize, African Region and the Commonwealth Prize for Literature. ta -da! I thank God. This is the story. Our Wife. They sit the heels of condemned criminals. It's a way of making sure they don't get to heaven. The angels might believe a certain soul looks well enough, but once that soul turns his back, he's done for. The soul is escorted to hell, the gashed heels telling the ugly tale. The red ripe bruises on my heels brought home these thoughts with a certain insistence. No one had cut my heels, but the bruises were there all the same. It was the wrapper of heavy woven material, which some Nigerians call a shoke, that did it. It zagged and cut its edge into my alien, unaccustomed flesh until every movement was agony. I began to feel like Hans Andersen's little mermaid, the mermaid turned woman who for love of an earthling gave up her life in the element, the nether depths of her sea and change her fish's tail for human legs. Every step was pain for her. Like cutting swords in tender flesh, the writer said. Pain for her love of an earthling prince. Pain for her lost life in the sea. Pain for her love of an earthling prince who could not begin to fathom her depths, her element. Pain, pain and more pain. The rapper was a sword. Thank you for listening. That was an extract from my short story entitled, Our Wife. I'm Karen King Arubisala, and this is Karen's Kingdom. Goodbye.